P. P is for popper. Hey, P for popper. What the carrot cake? <laughs> oh, hi, Plum. You startled me there. Ooh, sorry, popper. I didn't mean to startle you. Are you okay? The real question, Plum, are you okay? You sound different. I do. Oh, you're talking about my voice. Yeah, my voice is so deep. It is deep. It doesn't even sound like the rest of us. I know. Is that bad or good? Well, it's kind of... Awkwardness. Stupidly. Stupid. You think my voice is stupid? No, 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 no. I, I said I think your voice is all right. Oh, I thought at first you thought my voice was stupid. I thought you would love my new voice. That's letting me know I'm about to be a big boy soon. Yeah, you're about to be a big boy indeed. But your voice wasn't always like that. Well, I don't know what happened. I woke up this morning sounding like this. I don't know what to do to fix it. I think I know what to do. We should take you to the hospital. No way! Ah! I'm getting away from you before you try to take me anywhere. See ya, Popper. Wait, Plum, wait. We gotta see what's wrong with your voice. You sound disgusting. You sound like a little bang. Uh, Dern, how dare Popper try to take me away? All because my voice sounds different. I love my voice. I don't know about him. You know what? I'm gonna go see what Chuck thinks. Chuck! Chucky boy! Chuck! What's up, brother? Plum, why do you sound like that? Oh, I'm glad someone thinks my voice is funny. Your voice does sound funny, but seriously, why do you sound like that? I don't know! All of our voices sound the same. All of the Teal's voices sound the same. You're not supposed to sound like that. Oh, well, I don't know. I guess my voice is going to be like this for the rest of my life. Well, I wouldn't say for the rest of your life when you get up into a grown man. Even I did have this voice for a day. What's the big lemon squeeze? The big lemon squeeze? Man, your voice sounds like you've been drinking. Your voice sounds you've been eating balloon helium for breakfast. Even when I took a bite out of that balloon, it popped. You have sharp teeth. It was good. <sighs> Man, your voice is really starting to be a little bit terrifying, ferocious for a Halloween voice. No, this is a Halloween voice. What are you doing, man? Ah, forget it. What? Oh, please tell me that new voice didn't affect you. It didn't affect me. It just freaked me out. You know what? While he's trying to get mad at me about it like Popper, I love my voice. I don't see how anyone doesn't like my new voice. It sounds amazing. I am a man now. I don't know why my voice sounds like that, but I'm a stupid. I love my voice. Plum, are you all right? What's up, Stax? You want something to me? Come on, I'll give you something to me. Come on, let's go. You want to judge me for how my voice sounds, huh? You want to judge me for being a grown man? Why do you sound like that? Oh, see? Now you want to start something with me in my voice. My voice is a problem to you? All right, then. I'd like you to try me. Beat my chest. Beat my chest. I'll beat your nose. Come on, let's go. You want some? I thought not. We need to do something. All right, guys. We need to talk. Plum's new voice, it sounds scary. What has he been doing? Eating some balloon helium? I say we find a way to turn his voice back into his normal voice, just like our voices. I say let's give him some water to drink. Negatory, negative. I don't think water's gonna be good enough. Maybe give him a cough drop? He's not coughing. Well, I don't know anything! I'm just so scared about his voice! Why do you think we're trying to figure out a situation for this? Well, your situations are good enough. Find something different. Wait a minute. Unless we can just take him to a hospital. I already tried that. He's too scared. He may be scared about it, but we're scared of him. Oh. You know, I don't think I'm starting to like my new voice, but I love it. Maybe if people stop hurting my feelings about it, I won't be so sad about it. I love my love my man. Why am I saying stuff that doesn't even have no words? Oh, hi, Plum. Talking to yourself? <gasps> hey, Ely. What's up, girl? I love you. 
You're beautiful. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, someone sounds new. Yeah, Ely, you love my new voice. It's losing. <laughs> Plum, you sound funny. All right, Plum, stop trying to play games with me. I know you sound all awesome and cute and all manlish. <laughs> Just go back to your regular voice. I can't. This is my new voice now. Wait, what? Your new voice now? Yeah, girl! Yeah, baby! This is my new voice! Oh! I didn't expect that to happen. I didn't either! So I guess for now on, you're gonna start healing me with a deep voice. I can even sing a song about it. I got a deep voice. My voice is all deep. You know what else is deep? My whole man body. I got me some red shoes. I got me some black jeans. But that's okay, because I'm plumb the t eagle. Hey! I'm a DJ solo slick rapper. <laughs> or should I say, <laughs> evil laugh. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to deal with this. I will. See you later, Ely girl. Stay cool out there. Bye-bye. <laughs> Wait a minute. Can I still do my Tigo laugh? I did it, 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 it. Hey, I can still do my Tigo laugh. I did it. it, 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 it. You know what? I think the new Tigo laugh sounds more better than this. Don't you agree? I did it. I did it. I did it. Carrots. I did it. Speaking of carrots, I felt like having some carrots. Anyone got any carrots? This is so night in. Ah. There he is. Why is he chilling out? I don't think so. <laughs> ah! Hey, unhug me. Hi, Plum. Stacks. Chuck Popper! What are you freaks doing here? We came to take you to the hospital, Plum. We gotta fix that voice of yours. Scram away, Lolos! Hey, Plum! Guys, your brother! Oh, hi, Ely! Did you know about this, too? Yeah! Why does Plum sound like that? I don't know, man! He sounds... nasty. That's the nastiest voice I ever heard. It was funny at first. Until I heard it was going to be like that forever. No way, there has to be a cure. A cure for what? Hi, Chanko. Plum sounds weird. Really, guys? He sounds weird? Yeah, do you not hear him? Uh, wait, is that Plum over there? Hey, the piece of resistance. That's how I like it. Jeez, <laughs> Plum sounds disgusting. It's nasty. It's heartfelt evil. It's a dump of dirty silverware. And we gotta do something about it. But why does he sound like that? Maybe it's puberty? Ugh, Chico. Come on, Ely. You mean, your voice can change if you hit puberty. No way, he's too young for puberty. Or else, something he must have eaten. I'm telling you, it's balloon helium. No way, there's no way. Hey, Plum, come here. What, so you can take me to the doctor to change my new manly voice? Nah, -uh, stay out of me. Plum, get over here. Yep, yep, poodle. What did you say to me? You know what, dude? We say get over here. Stay back. Oh, shut up. Come here. Come here. Stop. Let me go. You're making a big mistake. I want to keep my voice. I want to keep it. Let me keep it, please. No. It's annoying us. Say, ah. Ah. Definition in full definition. Uh, okay, that's enough. I'm not seeing anything. Just black and teeth. You don't see nothing? I don't see nothing. So it's not puberty. Uh, Chico, uh, have some respect in my name, boy. Put some respect in my name, boy. I'm sorry, Plum. I thought it was puberty. I told you he was too young, Chico. Well, hey, forgive me, Stax. So if it's not puberty, and it's not nothing he ate, what's causing it? Maybe he swallowed his voice intestines. That's it. He swallowed his voice intestines. You got it, Shermie. How do you mind, Miss Shermie? Give me a dick, Shermie. Give me a break, Shermie. You're a possum and a dog trying to catch a little cat in the tree, Shermie. Stop calling me Shermie. Well, now that we found out the case on what's causing his voice to sound like a zombie bird, how do we fix it? Now, don't worry. 
I got three options. First option, take him to a doctor. I'd rather go in the freezer and turn myself into a popsicle stick that you can get around the trucks at summertime. Second option, we can give him some medicine, you know, some good cough syrup. Well, you give him some syrup medicine, it's probably not going to do that much. Yeah, because, you know, you just gave it to him, it's probably going to take a few days. Yeah, we don't want to wait a few days. What's the third option? The third. I'm the third. What's the third option? Well, you're not going to like this. W what is it? No, you're not going to handle it. Well, how do we know? You never said it yet. Okay. Promise you don't want to get crazy about this? It depends on what it is. <laughs> it may be a little funny. The third option? Beating the dog out of your throat. <laughs> say ha! You say ha! You say ha! You heard me. Beating the dog out of your throat. Excuse me, girl. Man, man I slapped you like a ginger. Whoa, I didn't see that coming. Wait, you saying we should punch him in his throat? We should punch him in his throat. Girl, you touch me. I'm not trying to hit a girl, man. Man. Man, I'll bust your... Man, I'll bust your ear before you even hear anything about it. What do you think, guys? Option one, two, or three? And to be fair, I'm gonna go with three. Don't you dare! Well, punching Plum in the throat sounds a little bit mean and, you know, just honorary. But then... Punching him in the throat could teach him a lesson about trying to scare us with that voice. What I do? I didn't do nothing. What, what I do? And it's also a good idea because it'll give the ratings to this episode to be in a comedy. And y'all just love breaking the fourth wall. Option three it is. We're punching him in the throat. No, you're not. Stay out. You know what? Stay out of me. I'll bust you up. Man, I'll bust you. And I'll bust you. And I'll bust you. And I'll bust you. Shh. It's okay, Plum. Come here. No, Ely, leave me alone. You're not going to punch me. Why you can't use the first two options? Why you have to go with three? I hate three. Don't go with it. <sighs> it's going to be over in just a minute. Are you going to kick me instead? You're just discovering good stuff so fast, are you? No, 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 stop. <sighs> Can someone go get him, please? <laughs> good luck, you guys. You will not lay one finger on my throat. Give me a quick run. What the? I thought you guys hunted you. Finally, a perfect standard. Hiya! Ouch! Ow! What was that for? Didn't I tell you guys I didn't want to get punched in the throat? Well, you don't listen. You don't listen. You don't listen. Listen. Plug your voices back. No! You guys ruined my man voice. Boy, be happy. I did it again. It was time to get your voice back, Plum. You sounded very scary. That's why I loved it so much. All thanks to Girly over here. I lost it. Well, you should be happy and thankful. You're not even a grown man yet. Enjoy being a kid while you can with your voice being a kid. You lost my beautiful, handsome, manly voice. I'm gonna... Whoa, Plum, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. I was just trying to... Whoa, 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 Plum. You can't hit a girl. You know that. She's a girl. You can't hit a girl. Yeah, dude. A boy hitting a girl? That shit's super wrong. And that's probably against a rule. Okay, then I'll pretend you're Ely and I'll punch you. Punch! You know, that made me feel good. In fact, me doing that, that made me forget about me having that manly voice.